Hello everyone, I am back with another video and this time I just come up with a very interesting video. So in this video you have to guess a specific scientific term by the emoji. But keep in mind you have only 10 seconds to guess the correct term. After 10 seconds the right answer will be displayed. If you need more time so you can pause the video and think. So without any delay, just move to the terms here so you have to guess that what are the what term you can make by these two emojis and the time is just running out be quick so time is up so here it makes t cell because the first emoji is of t and the second emoji is of cell so if you combine these two t cell so it will make a term that is T cells. So all of you know the T cells are the immune cells which are also called as T lymphocytes and these are the major parts of immune system and they develop in thymus from the stem cells <clears throat> and they are responsible for adaptive immunity. Now next term just guess the time is running out. Here the two emojis, three emojis are there. So now you have to guess the term which these emojis make when you combine. So here the term is antibody because the first emoji is N, then T and body. So it makes antibody. So all of you know the antibodies are the glycoproteins produced by plasma B cells in response to antigens and ultimately they trigger the immune response. Now the next puzzle is Again, you have to guess the scientific term by these two emojis. Time is running out. So, the correct answer is gene gun because the first emoji is of gene and other is of gun. So, gene gun is a technique in which DNA is just, you can say, shoot inside a cell the dna is just coated on the golden beads and these beads are just shoot on the cell so that dna get inserted inside the cell so it is a delivery method next term again there are four emojis and you have to guess the scientific term which these all four emojis makes so here answer is DNA micro injection. So, because emojis are DNA, then MI means my. Here, the cro and injection. So, DNA micro injection. So, again, the DNA micro injection is a technique which is used to transfer the DNA into cell. So, here, the DNA is just micro injected into the cell. Next, again, the two emojis, and you have to get the correct scientific term. So time is up and answer is callus because the first emoji is of call and then us means us so it makes callus. So all of you know the callus is a mass of unorganized and undifferentiated cells of plant. So these, the callus is made up when we make the plant during plant tissue culture. Next puzzle is again three emojis. So here, these emojis make goal Z body. That is, first emoji is of goal, then G, and third one is of body. So it makes goal Z body. So all of you know the goal Z body is an organelle uh, which present in the cell and helps in the protein targeting. The next puzzle is time starts now. So the answer is DNA fingerprinting because three emojis are there. First is DNA, then second represent the finger and third represent the printing. So DNA fingerprinting. So it is a technique in which we just use person's DNA to determine their identity. It is also known as DNA profiling or molecular typing. The next puzzle is here three emojis are there. Oh, I
So here plant tissue culture first emerges of plant then of tissue then culture so plant tissue culture is a technique in which we just grow the plant under a septic condition in the lab The next puzzle is So here the answer is cell lines because the emojis represent cell and second one is of lines. So you know the cell lines are a group of cells which are cultured. So these are usually the population of many. You can say the population of same type of cells. Next puzzle is. So here the answer is C DNA library because the first emoji is of C, then DNA, and the third one is of library. So C DNA library is so these are the collection of cloned DNA fragment that are complementary to messenger RNA extracted from the organism or tissue, and they are inserted into host cell. So the next puzzle is. So here, cell wall because first emerges of cell and second is of wall. So cell wall, so cell wall is a structure that is generally made up of cellulose, which is present in the plant cell and helps the cell to take its shapes and also protect the cell. So this is all about this video. So hope you like the video, and if you really like the video, then hit the like button. and do subscribe this channel so that's all for today guys see you in the next video